Hello. Hello. Today we're flying with British Airways in first class. We're flying on their 787 Dreamliner from London to San Jose, California. We're currently in the SoF Hotel at Terminal 5, so we're now going to head over to the first wing and check in. So the first wing is located in Zone J, where you can check your bags in, and then there is a private security lane which brings you out into Galleries First. You can find the Concord room by just exiting Galleries First and walking in straight on. Concord Room is the British Airways lounge for passengers travelling in first class. Uh, it has features such as a bar where you can order cocktails, uh, there's loads of seating, um, there's a terraced area which has really comfy seats and great views out onto the tarmac and there's also this a la carte dining area uh, where you can sit down and dine as if you're in a restaurant. You can also book uh, cabanas which are like private little rooms with showers um, but we decided not to on this trip. This is the Concord Room Egg Benedict. And we've got some fruit. Okay, we're currently on the terrace in the Concord Room and we're watching the planes out the front, seeing what's happening there. We've just had our spa treatments, which you can book with the new first team 28 days before your flight is due to leave. And uh, you get a free 15 minute slot, so if you fly first, you can choose what treatment you'd like. I had the Elmis facial. I had a power back massage, which was really nice to well, you. So I uh, recommend definitely you book before you fly because on the day if you turn up you're unlikely to get hungry. On the terrace you can order some food if you get hungry. And so what are your choices? If you don't fancy anything that's on the a la carte menu, you can order from this menu and still have it sat down in the Concorde dining room. So we've come back round to the Concord Dining to have a little snack before we board. This is the menu that's on offer. So we got the Meze platter. They gave, wanted to give us one each, but we wanted to just share one because we didn't want to overeat. So when we boarded we were given pre-departure beverages, some nuts, our mean tickets and pyjamas. The crew were really friendly. So let me give you a little tour of the uh, first class seat on the BA 787-9. To the side of the aisle here you have this small compartment with a coat hanger. 
and then down under this you have a more larger storage compartment. Uh, I actually put my shoes in here. Then over to the left hand side of the seat and slightly to behind you have this storage compartment here. Uh, I fit my camera in there uh, and the passport and it also has a little mirror as well. Down next to your seat you'll find a remote control for the in-flight entertainment which you can use this or you can actually just touch on the screen. Next to it is a small compartment with a charging point, uh, like USB for example. So above this you'll find like a control panel. It has various buttons on it to control like the lamp, um, your seat and also light above your seat. Um, so you just have to kind of twist the knob depending on whether you've selected the lamp or you've selected seat alteration. Behind it is a button to dim the windows. Um, there's sort of five different levels of dimming and you can set it to however you want. There, this does replace the fact that there is no window blinds. The tray table is stored under here. Press this button to pop it out and then it comes out this way. You can have it out half or you can fold it open the whole way. The tray table is sturdy and it does slide forward so you can get out of your seat without having to put it away. You receive an amenities kit which comes with a lot of Elmer's products for your face. It includes the basics, the toiletries, the flight socks, the eye mask and the earbuds. Also a pen. So this was the menu that was on board our flight. So in first class you can do something called buddy dining. Now this is a really nice experience um, but what I will say is there was certainly more space for us to do buddy dining when we did it on the 747 than there was on the 787 and this is just because of the difference of the position of the uh, in-flight entertainment screen which is fixed on the 787 but uh, currently is a swing out screen on the 747. So the seats in first class convert into fully flat beds and the crew will actually make up your bed for you and uh, it was really comfy and there was more than enough space for myself. Once I uh, woke up I asked for a cappuccino and some fresh fruit and the crew brought it over promptly. So there was a second light meal served on board during our flight, however we didn't really like the menu so I had the starter here which is the duck. Um, but then we both had what was actually a snack on the menu but the trio of sliders which was actually really good. In summary, I had a really good flight, uh, thoroughly enjoying the ground experience at Terminal 5 and the crew on board were fantastic um, and I would definitely fly BA first again. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to San Jose where the local time is 10 past 6 in the evening.